Welcome, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, for the Alp Awards for FIFA 2014. It is back. This is for FIFA 2014. However, we will be doing one once a month once FIFA 15 comes out. If you have not seen the Alp Awards before, sit back, relax, and enjoy. So the first award of the night, guys, is going to be, as always, biggest pull there's two here for you guys the first one was on the world cup which was this man cristiano ronaldo but he doesn't really count so how does this one stack up closer 90 rated super duper special closer pulled today believe it or not first owner check that out how do you like them apples was so pleased with that fantastic pull next award is for the biggest loss the most money that i have lost on a player in FIFA 14, and it is uh, Jaime Jimmy Rodriguez or James Rodriguez, depending on how you want to call it, depending on whether you uh, you speak the tongue or not, so to speak. But um, yeah, I bought him literally as he came out. Thought, yeah, let's do a review on him. It was when I was in that kind of should I, shouldn't I regarding YouTube, and I lost 300k after tax. A bit of blow indeed, guys. A bit of blow indeed most expensive player this is a double award and it actually follows on with a triple award but the most expensive player that i bought in ultimate team for fifa 14 plus the highest rated player that i used in fifa 14 now don't bear in mind i didn't play that much of ultimate team in uh, fifa 14 was cristiano ronaldo we paid just over a million for him when we were actually purchasing him and he is the highest rated player that I've used. Not used any of the informs with regards to uh, Ronaldo's. Not used Messi. So Cristiano Ronaldo gets the award for highest rated and most expensive player. He also gets the reward for the most profit, guys. I bought Cristiano Ronaldo. It's coming up now. You'll see a picture of him. I bought Cristiano Ronaldo right before team of the season. Right in the thick of the market crash. I paid just over a million for him and i sold him three or four weeks later and made a whopping 900k profit after tax it was an absolute brilliant deal i got ibra for 500k as well sold him for 1.1 million so real good deals to be had during the uh, market crash guys most coins that i had throughout the whole of ultimate team 14 was wait for it 4.5 million that is the most coins i had i know some youtubers have had 36 million coin wages all that shite not me 4.5 million and i used it fairly well to be honest with you moving on to my favorite player i'll stick some music up just enjoy no there ain't no stopping us fly without boarding pass couldn't catch me i'll be moving fast Shooting star Let me know you are Flying up in a bar Wish on a star Time to show them who's in charge Call me a shooting star Ibra, guys. Ibra, need I say more? Honestly, the guy is an absolute phenomenon. Next award is for the most fun team. The team that I enjoyed using the most. And it was the Keanu Boss team, as I call it. So, Czech, Clichy, Kachelny, Kabul. You've got uh, Walker, Matuidi, Gorin, I think he is. Uh, Barbo, um, Muriel, um, 
and just Menez, just that team, guys, in there, that guys. I was playing them basically with um, Ronaldo on the bench, so that was the team layout I had, and then bringing Ronaldo on as I needed, just showing you there how I would switch the team up, guys. But that is essentially it, Barbo and Ibra up front, got 99 chemistry or 100 chemistry, however you couch it. Team that was come up by Keanu Boss, the lad is a beast, check his channel out if you don't see him or if you haven't seen him already. And here's a few goals from that team so i think it's guarine um, scoring an absolute barnstormer of a shot cracking shot from her then you've got menez looking to put that ball in pings a ball over the top comes out lands at the fleet of him again and a really really nice finish there guys and once again we get the ball walker playing it out lovely team goal this guys muriel Playing a beautiful threaded ball through and a cheeky, cheeky Abarbo chip there just to see them off. So that is the most fun team, guys, that I have used. And that brings me on to my favourite director throughout the whole of Ultimate Team 14. It's a guy I've been friends with for a while. It is a guy that I have known for a long time. He has worked his arse off on YouTube and he is very, very deserving of this award, guys. It is Derek rants gaming knocking on the door of a hundred thousand subscribers i've done a little montage of some of derek's best bits from fifa 14 and i'm just going to sit back relax play the footage and hopefully get you to sub afterwards guys enjoy Defending like a bloody boss, but passing like an absolute dick. No, look, look, look! Trying to gift it to fucking Eber, the game fuck. Fucking, fucking, fucking AIDS! It's so AIDS and rigged. Why you celebrate like you've scored the best goal ever? You fucking lucky bastard! The game is invented to just gift Ebra goals. So, why is it different? Because we're not going to do any FIFA. We're going to, um, we're going to read some hate comments. I've seen a few YouTubers do it. They seem to do well. So I thought to myself, why the fuck not? You make me laugh. Nice videos, bro. Smiley face. Could you not do it? Could you even not have put a bloody angry face at the end just to make it slightly hateful? Been a fan since last year, I'm so happy I've watched your channel grow over the past year and I've seen the content get even better, keep it up man. Right, okay, maybe, maybe there's some hate in that comment. Maybe when he says keep it up man, he's suggesting that I can't keep an erection. Just because I'm old, doesn't mean I can't keep a bonnet. I can't keep a bonnet. I don't know why it goes limp, it goes like a bloody freshly squeezed sausage. Yes please! Oh yes please, he's offside, leave it, leave it, leave it, surely, surely we've won, no he's going to lump it forward, he's kicked it out, yes, oh my fucking days, come on baby, fuck it you spin me right wrong baby, right wrong like a wrecking baby, I can't stop, oh my god, Funny as shit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Funny as shit. Since when was shit funny? Oh, yeah. This time to the Christmas poop. Oh, what have we got in this little beauty? Peter Check. All right, your helmet wearing bastard. That's an 85 rated. Which, you know, isn't a bad start, but he's not worth a whole lot, is he? Oh, shitty bum Fletcher, shitty bum Fletcher, do do diddly do do. I'm sexually attracted to Derek, the getting nicer. What a sack of shit. Whoa, we got crazy spider head. <clears throat> yep, nobody gives a shit about discarding that, so there we go, diddly do, diddly bong, diddly bing bing. Gone, down the toilet, let's move on. Fact number two, this puppy's all mine. Come on, baby. Show me some green. Show me some green. I'm feeling it. 
I'm feeling it. Come on. Come. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Can you feel it? Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. The bottom line is, I get very little hate. I've honestly got the best subscribers in the world. I hope that continues. The odd hate comment, I just laugh at him. Make a show of him. You guys love it. I love you guys. Hit like on the video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time. So there you are guys, Derek Rants Gaming, in my opinion, one of the best, most inventive channels around on YouTube at the moment. He's got his Russian Roulette series where he basically discards certain packs, keeps certain packs. He's got his pink slips, wager matches, all that sort of stuff. Just a genuine, nice down to earth guy and please don't take him to get him to take the mask off because at the end of the day the mask the, ca the Derek character the mask is what makes him such a unique cool channel keep the mask on forever Derek I'm sure you look beautiful underneath it that is Derek Rance Gaming check him out please subscribe to him it would mean an awful lot to me to check him out I know he's on 100k but um, even if we get him 10 subs it's 10 subs better than nothing guys so please check out Derek Rance Gaming and finally, we are left with my favourite goal of FIFA 14. You guys know I haven't played that much Ultimate Team. I haven't played that much FIFA 14. I'm into more of the career mode stuff now. And I'm going to be doing some FIFA Ultimate Team and career mode during uh, FIFA 15. But this is a little cheeky long shot from uh, Non-Infurm Matweedy. So check it out, guys. Just enjoy it. It isn't the greatest goal you'll ever see. But it's the most fun and favourite goal that I scored throughout ultimate team 14 just on the edge pings it over the top and absolutely kills the keeper dead it is not the best goal you'll see it is not the most skillful goal but it is the goal that put the biggest smile on my face and it was right at the start of a match against a guy called sex at the end of the day if you're gonna have sex as your three digit um, team name then you deserve to have goals like that put in against you so look at that boom Keeper wasn't off his line much, and that's what made it an even better goal. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. I really appreciate it, and let's bring some more Alp Awards back for FIFA 15. Thank you, and good night.